Hello, my dear students. This is the continued discussion of the chapter Is Matter Around Us Pure? In the previous video, we had discussed what is pure substance and what are types of pure substance and even we have discussed about mixture, its types and even solution and its properties. We have discussed about concentration of solution. What is concentration of solution? It's nothing but amount of solute present in amount of solution, which can be used to explain diluted, concentrated or saturated solution. Saturated solution is one such solution in which maximum amount of solute has been dissolved and no extra solute can be dissolved in it, right? Now, the amount of solute that is present in the saturated solution is called its solubility, right? Now, we were discussing about the Calculation of concentrated solute, concentration of solution using the formula, okay, that is concentration of solution is equal to amount of solute divided by amount of solute, so solution. If we want to present it in terms of mass by mass percentage, it is um, mass of solute divided by mass of solvent into 100, okay. So, related to this, let's find out, let's solve it problem which is given in your in-text textbook also, in text also, that is to make a saturated solution, 36 gram of sodium chloride is dissolved in 100 gram of water at 293 Kelvin. Find its concentration at this temperature. Here they have given amount of sodium chloride is 36 gram um, and amount of water is 100 gram. Okay, temperature is given at that particular temperature, we should find out What's the concentration? Okay. So, given is mass of solute, that is NaCl, 36 gram, and mass of solvent water, that is 100 gram, right? So, mass of solution will be sum of mass of solute and mass of solvent, right? So, mass of solution will be mass of solute plus mass of solvent, which will be equal to 36 plus 100, that is 136 grams. Now, we need to find out the concentration by mass by mass percent, that is mass of solute by mass of solvent into 100. So, the equation will be 36 by 136 into 100, that is 26.47%. So, this is how by given values, you should be find, we should be finding out the concentration of the solution. Now, let us understand the further concept of the chapter, that is, what is suspension? Suspension is another type of mixture okay so mixture ali now previous class ali previous video dali homogeneous mixture adanta solution bagge kalpkondvi now our discussion is heterogeneous solution in case of homogeneous solution it's called as solution okay solution can be homogeneous or uh, sorry mixture can be mixture can be homogeneous or it can be heterogeneous. How the one? Let me heterogeneous. Heteron. Homogeneous mixture na yinan takaritare. It's called a solution. Solution is the homogeneous mixture. Heterogeneous mixture can be suspension. Okay. Or it can be collide or it can be collide. So, in case of mixture, we have discussed about this homogeneous solution, homogeneous mixture that is solution. Now, we need to discuss about this suspension and collide. Okay, now. So, let us discuss about this suspension first. Then we'll go for collide. What is suspension? Let us understand. Suspension is nothing but a heterogeneous mixture in which the solute is in larger molecule size or larger particular size. Particles are larger and they do not dissolve in solution. I mean in solvent. They do not dissolve. This is very, very important. 
they do not dissolve but remain suspended andre neerge nanu marlanna hakadre that sand do not dissolve but it gets suspended in the solution and such type of mixture is called as suspension as it is suspended in the solution it is called as suspension got it okay next point particles will be visible to our naked eyes because it will be more than 100 nanometer more than 100 nanometer rodake particles kannu kaanisutte for example sand in water okay that's an example for suspension or even if you take suspension antandre Mm, wheat flour in water okay wheat flour in water do not dissolve okay it's a suspension okay now in case of suspension particles he gets solutionally it is solution at the bond right a solutionally particles either spread out agar yellow do kargirala dissolve agirala okay so example is muddy water is also a suspension muddy water this is actually muddy water. Muddy water. That's also an example for suspension. So suspension ge examples I have given. One is sand in water. Another one is muddy water. Another one it is a uh, oh, floor. Okay. Any floor in water wheat flour or any other flour in water is also a suspension. So these are suspensions. So these suspensions will have particular properties. Let us discuss about those properties of suspension now. Properties of suspension. First of all, one property we already know. Third, it is a heterogeneous mixture. Second property also we know. Particle size is greater than 100 nanometer. Okay, particle size just the itaga when the light passes, particle will disperse that light, right? So let's discuss them. It's a heterogeneous mixture. Particles of suspension can be seen by naked eye because it's greater than 100 nanometer. The particles of suspension scatter a beam of light. Particles do die ro dake light adramele hit tada ka all light scatter aage hogatte. Aage pasa ko kagala. Scatter agate because particles do die there. Scatter agiro light to namma kanike kaansatte. Okay. So that makes the path of the light visible. Light kaansatala. Adre hokta ero dhari nu kuda kaansatte. For example, you know, uh, early in the morning when you are, uh, when you have woke up and uh, in from your window is small amount of ray of light is coming okay and when it is coming the path of light will be visible because in that path you will see many particles of dust moving okay because those particles are scattering the light when the light has scattered then the path of the light will be visible to us next the solute particles settle down when a suspension is left undisturbed nevo sand matte neerana thagondu mix maadi Mix mud like a sand particle, it is nearly mix agaratala. Other na mix agaratha will dissolve agarala. Other na sulpath hagi disturb mud the itre sand particle slowly kill a gade settle. So suspension no stir mud daga one the property. I mean particles in lump solutely solventally suspend agaratha and disturb the gate and settle agaratala. Adukuskara it said that that. Uh, suspension is unstable. It is unstable. In a country, sometimes particles spreads out, sometimes particles settles down. Yawaglu one tara ilde erodake, it's called as unstable. Shall I move ahead? So it's unstable. Next, particles can be separated from the mixture by the process of filtration. Nanu sand mate water na separate mat de kondra when the filter paper na to go funnel ke haki other mulga when I'll pass sand water water comes down and sand settles on the filter paper because filter paper 
sorry, sand particles are much bigger than the pores in the filter paper. So that sand cannot go inside those pores. Hence, it will separate out by the process of filtration. Got it? So these are few properties that it is heterogeneous mixture. Particles of suspension is visible to naked eyes and it can uh, scatter the beam of light, makes the path of the light visible and it is unstable as it settles down when kept undisturbed for some time and also it can be separated by the process of filtration. Next, let us go for another type of mixture heterogeneous mixture that is colloidal solution. Makle namo homogeneous mixture ali we have understood about solution. Heterogeneous mixture ali we have understood about um, suspension. Now it is about colloidal solution. What is this colloidal solution? Colloidal solution ke first in an example kot birthine that is milk is actually colloidal solution. Milk. Milk Obviously, will be with water. So, milk with water is an example for colloidal solution. So, the particles of the collides are uniformly spread throughout the solution. Milk and near hakadra for near and milk hakadra, whatever. So, after a matter of milk, it is. So, particles of collide are uniformly spread throughout the solution. Next, due to relatively smaller size of the colloidal particles, okay, compared to the suspension, the mixture appears to be homogeneous. Milk and water mix homogeneous. But actually, colloidal solution is a heterogeneous mixture. In reality, it's actually heterogeneous mixture. In case of solution, okay, particle size, particle size is less than 1 nanometer. Alba. In case of suspension, particle size is more than 100 nanometer. Alva. In case of collide, particle size is between 1 nanometer to 100 nanometer. 200 nanometer. Adukos kara particles kanna kansala. Kanni kans de erudakke namage homogeneous ansatte. But it's not homogeneous. It is heterogeneous. Make sure. Got it? Shall I move ahead children? Okay, let me move ahead. I'll erase this. Even in pit polinum, easy agate. Okay, solution particle size less than one nanometer, suspension more than 100 meter, collided solution in between solution and suspension. So let me erase this and move ahead for further discussion. Properties of colloidal solution, right? Yeah, here is a picture of milk, which is an example for collide. So, properties of collide, it's a heterogeneous mixture. Though it appears homogeneous, in actual, it is heterogeneous mixture. The size of the particles of collide are too small to be visible to the naked eyes. That is, it is between 1 nanometer to 100 nanometer. Too small to be visible to our naked eyes. The, but it scatters. But it's big enough to scatter the ray of light. It scatters the ray of light, hence make the path of the light visible. Collide is quite stable. Adhan nivya shtok taru halan na haage idi. Halan particles kele gade settle laga daagli. Neer mele ero daagli. Aagala. It is stable. Okay. Suspension tara kele gade settle laagala. Ena kandre particle size ho. Suspension hol sudre chikta da girat la. Suspension to particle size dood da girat la. Adhan na sulpa hota haage idi. Gravity ga di kele aagade barat. Illi haage ab. A concept work aagala. Ena kandre particle size chikta da girat. Cannot be separated by the process of filtration. Filtration in the separate mode of agala. Yena kandre particle size 1 nanometer in the 100 nanometer rodrinda. Particle is smaller than the pores in the filter paper. Okay. Particles. Particles. Are smaller than pores 
in filter paper. That's why it cannot be separated by filtration. But we can separate the collide by a process called centrifugation. By the process called centrifugation, we can separate it. Can you see here? Centrifugation in the separate marble. In the centrifugation, we use the coming of slides. We discuss modern. But it's a technique to separate the components of collides that you should remember. Okay. Shall I move ahead? Properties of collide we have discussed. It's a heterogeneous mixture. Particle size is between 1 nanometer to 100 nanometer. Particle size is cannot be visible to naked eyes. Particle size is enough, large enough to scatter the ray of light, which makes the path of the light visible. And it cannot be separated by filtration, but we can separate it by, separate it by centrifugation. Mundhogana. Fine, let me move ahead. Yeah, in case of this, um, um, this collide, this is very, very important property, Tyndall effect. What is this Tyndall effect? Tyndall effect is properties of collide where we light can scatter due to the particles of collide. That's called as Tyndall effect. This is called as Tyndall because it was it is named under a scientist named Tyndall. It is first candidate Tyndall and the scientist or the post Tyndall effect. So scattering of beam of light by particles of collide is called as Tyndall effect. So you will see Tyndall effect a lot many times in our day-to-day -day life. For example, here you can see this image. Okay, When the torch is passing through the solution of copper sulfate, which is a solution, it's a solution. It does not show Tyndall effect. Whereas when it's passed through mixture of milk, it shows Tyndall effect. Milk, because milk is collide. Collide show Tyndall effect. In case of collide, we can see Tyndall effect. Collides show Tyndall effect. Whereas, whereas solution and suspension in which particles Settled down, do not show, don't show Tyndall effect. Okay, na? So, any particles suspension only can get settled and get up the land is to murder the other. About the Tyndall effect, irala. Collides only matra yawagli no Tyndall effect irata. Even the now good day to day life, the Tumbakada in order the way, as I said just before, Nimaruma li, Nimu, when, when you get up early in the morning and the ray of light is passing through the window and you are folding a bed sheet, a bed sheet a little dool, in Madate, Bartairo. Light and a scatter madata a light num neat at a concept. But the stosala moda the light passagadu ray of light passagadu no dritira. I'll show you a few images of Tyndall effect. And even in the canopy of thick forest. Yeah. Here you can see Tyndall effect where we can see scattering of light due to the particle dust that's present in the forest. And this is also Tyndall effect through the clouds of Clouds of sky, light has scattered. Okay, na. In no one the property they makle that's of um, collides. Okay, colloidal property, colloidal property. In one the there that's called as Brownian movement. Brownian movement. What is this Brownian movement? It's also named under a scientist. Brown, Robert Brown or Kandidito, okay, Brownian moment and Tadro. A Brownian moment alina Gatandre. Here, particles are there, okay. These are particles of collide. Let us assume that these are particles of collide. Wait. Okay. So, here, particles of collides are there. So, these particles of Collide are in continuous movement. They are in continuous zigzag movement. Okay. In Madatendre, they'll go like this first. Then from here, it moves like this. 
then from here it goes like this then from here it comes like this are you seeing how it's moving then it can come here hope you are seeing this okay so ee tara zigzag movement mel hogutte kela hogutte mel hogutte kela hogutte mel hogutte kela hogutte ellaadru matte illinda matte ee kade mele hogbodu not like that kelagane ne barbeku anta matte illinda hege hogbodu ee zigzag movement enide zigzag movement of zigzag movement of particles of collide is called as brownian movement brownian movement anta karita zigzag movement na brownian movement anta karitare this is also seen in the canopy of the forest or even your um, bedroom when you uh, when you brew dust ella hogta iratalla kasa gudisuvaga a dust scatter avodu neat age namage kaanisutte that is brownian movement this is also one of the property of collide so we have understood lot many properties of collide in which very very important one mark question can be asked is about this tindal effect one is about this tindal effect one mark question or about this brownian movement gotaita makle shall i move ahead let me go ahead so here are most common collides ನಮ್ ಸುತ್ತಮುತ್ತ ತುಂಬಾ ಕೊಲೈಡ್ಸ್ ಇದೆ ಬಟ್ ಅದು ಕೊಲೈಡ್ ಅಂತಾನೆ ನಮ್ಗೆ ಗೊತ್ತಿರಲ್ಲ ಇದನ್ನ ಅರ್ಥ ಮಾಡ್ಕೊಳ್ಳೋದಕ್ಕಿಂತ ಮುಂಚೆ ಇನ್ ಸೊಲ್ಯೂಷನ್ ವಿ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಸೊಲ್ಯೂಟ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಸಾಲ್ವೆಂಟ್ ರೈಟ್ ಸೊಲ್ಯೂಷನ್ ಹ್ಯಾಸ್ ಸೊಲ್ಯೂಟ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಸಾಲ್ವೆಂಟ್ ಕರೆಕ್ಟ್ ಸೊಲ್ಯೂಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಪ್ರೆಸೆಂಟ್ ಇನ್ ಸ್ಮಾಲ್ ಅಮೌಂಟ್ solvent is present in large amount solute get dissolved in solvent solvent is a substance in which the solute get dissolved so illi collide alli also there will be two components one component which is similar to solute is dispersed phase it is dispersed phase and solvent tara jaasti amount alli present irodu matte its present it dissolves the dispersed phase in it is dispersed medium illi hesru matra bere solution alli solute matte solvent anta karithivi idralli dispersed phase matte dispersed medium anta karithivi gotayta makla so now moving ahead common examples daily life examples nodana dispersed solution no dis, sorry dispersed phase no dispersed medium no gas ar agirbodu liquid ar agirbodu solid ar agirbodu so liquid dispersed phase is liquid when the liquid is dissolved in gas when the liquid is dissolved in gas it's called as aerosol ಅದನ್ನ ಏರೋಸೋಲ್ ಅಂತ ಕರೀತಾರೆ ಎಕ್ಸಾಂಪಲ್ ಫಾಗ್ ಕ್ಲೌಡ್ ಮಿಸ್ಟ್ ಓಕೆ ಇವೆಲ್ಲಾನು ಎಕ್ಸಾಂಪಲ್ಸ್ ಫಾರ್ ಕೊಲೈಡ್ ಫಾಗ್ ಕ್ಲೌಡ್ ಮಿಸ್ಟ್ ಕ್ಲೌಡ್ ಅಲ್ಲಿ ಲಿಕ್ವಿಡ್ ಇಸ್ ವಾಟರ್ ಫಾಗು ಮಿಸ್ಟ್ ಅಲ್ಲೂ ಅಷ್ಟೇ ವಾಟರ್ ಗ್ಯಾಸ್ ಅಲ್ಲಿ ಮಿಕ್ಸ್ ಆಗಿರುತ್ತೆ ದಟ್ಸ್ ಕಾಲ್ಡ್ ಆಸ್ aerosol and these are the examples for collide then solid in gas kelosala solid to gas alli dissolve agirutte solid to gas alli dissolve aadrunu idanna aerosol anta karitare for example smoke automobile exhaust is smoke automobile exhaust alli they will have unburnt carbon particles c anta varithini so just a minute let me erase it okay in case of uh, smoke it will have unburnt carbon particles okay this unburnt carbon particles will be present in gas in case of automobile exhaust and smoke now next in case of gas in gas ilva hagadre gas in gas agibitre adu homogeneous mixture agutte that becomes homogeneous mixture enakandre gas innond gas alli neatage complete ag mix agibidutte adu homogeneous mixture agutte avaga navu adannu we call it as solution correct so it cannot be collide so now coming further uh, gas in liquid 
ಗ್ಯಾಸ್ ಇನ್ ಲಿಕ್ವಿಡ್ ಆದ್ರೆ ಏನಾಗುತ್ತೆ ಗ್ಯಾಸ್ ಇನ್ ಲಿಕ್ವಿಡ್ ಇಸ್ ಕಾಲ್ಡ್ ಅಸ್ ಫೋಮ್ ಫೋಮ್ ಅಂತ ಕರೀತಾರೆ ಫೋಮ್ ಅಂದ್ರೆ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ಶೇವಿಂಗ್ ಕ್ರೀಮ್ ಈಗ ಮತ್ತೆ ಫೋಮ್ ಅಂತಾನೆ ಬರುತ್ತೆ ಬರ್ತ್ಡೇ ಅಲ್ಲೇ ಬರ್ತ್ಡೇ ಬ್ಯಾಶ್ ಮಾಡುವಾಗ ನೀವು ಹಾಕ್ತಿರಲ್ಲ ಅದು ಫೋಮ್ ಏನೆ ನೆಕ್ಸ್ಟ್ ಲಿಕ್ವಿಡ್ ಇನ್ ಲಿಕ್ವಿಡ್ ಇದ್ರೆ ಅದು ಎಮಲ್ಷನ್ ಅಂತ ಕರಿತೀವಿ ಎಮಲ್ಷನ್ ಅಂತ ಮಿಲ್ಕ್ ಆರ್ ಫೇಸ್ ಕ್ರೀಮ್ ದೀಸ್ ಆರ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಕೊಲ್ಲೈಡ್ ನೋಡಿ ಮಿಲ್ಕ್ ಇಸ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಎಮಲ್ಷನ್ ವಾಟರ್ ಲಿಕ್ವಿಡ್ ಇನ್ ಲಿಕ್ವಿಡ್ ಫೇಸ್ ಕ್ರೀಮ್ ಇಸ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಎಮಲ್ಷನ್ ನೆಕ್ಸ್ಟ್ ಸಾಲಿಡ್ ಇನ್ ಲಿಕ್ವಿಡ್ ಇದ್ರೆ ಅದನ್ನ ಸಾಲ್ ಅಂತ ಕರಿತೀವಿ ಓಕೆ ಸಾಲ್ ಎಕ್ಸಾಂಪಲ್ ಮಿಲ್ಕ್ ಆಫ್ ಮೆಗ್ನೀಷಿಯಾ ಮಡ್ ದೀಸ್ ಆರ್ ಎಕ್ಸಾಂಪಲ್ ಫಾರ್ ಮಡ್ ಮಡ್ ಅಲ್ಲಿ ಕೂಡ ಅದು ಕೂಡ ಕೊಲಾಯ್ಡ್ ಏನೆ ಅದ್ರಲ್ಲಿನೂ ಸಾಲಿಡ್ ಲಿಕ್ವಿಡ್ ಅಲ್ಲಿ ಇರುತ್ತೆ ಮಡ್ ಅಂದ್ರೆ ಸ್ವಲ್ಪ ನೀರಿನ ಪ್ರಮಾಣ ಇರಲೇಬೇಕು ಜೊತೆಗೆ ಸಾಲಿಡ್ ಸಾಯಿಲ್ ಸಾಲಿಡ್ ಆಗುತ್ತೆ ದೆನ್ ಗ್ಯಾಸ್ ಇನ್ ಸಾಲಿಡ್ ಅದನ್ನು ಫೋಮ್ ಅಂತ ಕರಿತೀವಿ ಫೋಮ್ ಇರ್ಬೋದು ರಬ್ಬರ್ ಸ್ಪಾಂಜ್ ಪ್ಯೂಮಿಕ್ ಪ್ಯೂಮಿಕ್ ಸ್ಟೋನ್ ಅಂತ ಸಿಗುತ್ತೆ ಆ ಎಲ್ಲಿ ಅಂದ್ರೆ ಬ್ಯೂಟಿ ಪಾರ್ಲರ್ಸ್ ಅಲ್ಲಿ ಎಲ್ಲ ಇರತ್ತೆ ಪ್ಯೂಮಿಕ್ ಸ್ಟೋನ್ ಅಲ್ಲಿ ನೀವು ಏನು ಪೆಡಿಕ್ಯೂರು ಮೆನಿಕ್ಯೂರು ಮಾಡ್ತಾರೆ ಯೂಸ್ ಮಾಡ್ತಾರೆ ಪ್ಯೂಮಿಕ್ ಸ್ಟೋನ್ ಸ್ಟೋನ್ ಕ್ಲೀನ್ ಮಾಡೋದಕ್ಕೆ ಸೊ ದಟ್ಸ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಇನ್ ಎಕ್ಸಾಂಪಲ್ ಕೊಲಾಯ್ಡ್ ದೆನ್ ಲಿಕ್ವಿಡ್ ಇನ್ ಸಾಲಿಡ್ ವಿಚ್ ಇಸ್ ಕಾಲ್ಡ್ ಎಸ್ ಜೆಲ್ ದಿಸ್ ಜೆಲ್ ಜೆಲ್ಲಿ ಚೀಸ್ ಬಟರ್ ದೀಸ್ ಆರ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಕೊಲಾಯ್ಡ್ ದೆನ್ ಸಾಲಿಡ್ ಇನ್ ಸಾಲಿಡ್ ನ ಸಾಲಿಡ್ ಸೋಲ್ ಅಂತ ಕರೀತಾರೆ ಕಲರ್ಡ್ ಜೆಮ್ ಸ್ಟೋನ್ಸ್ ಕಲರ್ಡ್ ಜಮ್ ಸ್ಟೋನ್ಸ್ ವಿಚ್ ಇಸ್ ಯೂಸ್ಡ್ ಫಾರ್ ಜ್ಯುವೆಲ್ರೀಸ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಫಾರ್ ಡೆಕೋರೇಷನ್ ಪರ್ಪಸಸ್ ಮಿಲ್ಕಿ ಗ್ಲಾಸ್ ಮಿಲ್ಕಿ ಗ್ಲಾಸ್ ಅನ್ನ ಇದ್ರಲ್ಲೆಲ್ಲ ಯೂಸ್ ಮಾಡ್ತಾರಲ್ಲ ಮಕ್ಕಳೇ ಐ ಮೀನ್ ಬಿಲ್ಡಿಂಗ್ಸ್ ಅಲ್ಲಿ ಎಲ್ಲ ಯೂಸ್ ಮಾಡ್ತಾರೆ ವಿಂಡೋಸ್ಗೆ ಯೂಸ್ ಮಾಡ್ತಾರೆ ಮಿಲ್ಕಿ ಗ್ಲಾಸು ಹೊರಗಡೆ ಇರೋರ್ಗೆ ಒಳಗಡೆ ಇರೋರ್ ಕಾಣಲ್ಲ ಈವೆನ್ ಬಾತ್ರೂಮ್ಸ್ ಎಲ್ಲ ಗ್ಲಾಸ್ ಬಾತ್ರೂಮ್ಸ್ ಎಲ್ಲ ಇರತ್ತಲ್ಲ ಅಲ್ಲೆಲ್ಲ ಮಿಲ್ಕಿ ಗ್ಲಾಸ್ ನ ಯೂಸ್ ಮಾಡೋದು ಸೊ ದೀಸ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಆಲ್ ಆರ್ ಕೊಲಾಯ್ಸ್ ಯು ನೀಡ್ ನಾಟ್ ರಿಮೆಂಬರ್ ಆಲ್ ದೀಸ್ ಬಟ್ ಯು ಶುಡ್ ರಿಮೆಂಬರ್ ದಿಸ್ ದಟ್ ಸೊಲ್ಯೂಷನ್ ಇನ್ ಸೊಲ್ಯೂಷನ್ ಆಸ್ ಸೊಲ್ಯೂಟ್ ಇನ್ ಕೊಲಾಯ್ ಈಸ್ ಡಿಸ್ಪರ್ಸ್ ಪೇಸ್ ಇನ್ ಸೊಲ್ಯೂಷನ್ ಆಸ್ ಸಾಲ್ವೆಂಟ್ ಇನ್ ಕೊಲಾಯ್ ಈಸ್ ಡಿಸ್ಪರ್ಸ್ ಮೀಡಿಯಂ ಇಷ್ಟನ್ನು ನೀವು ನೆನಪಿಟ್ಟು ಗಾಟ್ ಇಟ್ ಚಿಲ್ಡ್ರನ್ ಮುಂದೆ ಹೋಗೋಣ ಸೊ ಲೆಟ್ ಮಿ ಮೂವ್ ಅಡ್ ಯಾ ಸೊ ಟಿಲ್ ನೌ ವಿ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಡಿಸ್ಕಸ್ಡ್ ಅಬೌಟ್ ಕೊಲಾಯ್ಟ್ ಸಸ್ಪೆನ್ಷನ್ ಅಂಡ್ ವಿ ಹ್ಯಾಡ್ ಆಲ್ರೆಡಿ ಡಿಸ್ಕಸ್ಡ್ ಅಬೌಟ್ ಸೊಲ್ಯೂಷನ್ ಸೊ ನೆಕ್ಸ್ಟ್ ಡಿಸ್ಕಶನ್ ವಿಲ್ ಬಿ ಅಬೌಟ್ ಹೌ ಟು ಸೆಪರೇಟ್ ದಿಸ್ ಮಿಕ್ಸರ್ಸ್ ಸೊ ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ವಿಲ್ ಬಿ ಅಬೌಟ್ ಸೆಪರೇಷನ್ ಟೆಕ್ನಿಕ್ಸ್ that i'll discuss in coming video thank you for your watching and please subscribe my channel if you want to if you like the videos please share with your friends and like my video if you really like it thank you meet you soon with another video shortly